I am headed to Dr. Camphers Exotic Animal Veterinary Center with Billy and uh, he wasn't doing great yesterday but he seemed to be doing a lot better this morning he has a lot of energy um, two days ago he was eating a lot of critical care yesterday not a whole lot but he seems to be in way better spirits even though he's been losing a lot of weight still um, so we got an appointment for Dr. Camphers in just an hour so I'm gonna get there and and she's reserved enough time to do dental work if need be and I gave them the rundown so that's where we're headed and Billy's been such an awesome fighter and it can't be good having soft poops for weeks you know it's really tough on him and and you know it's a lot of work giving him all this you know syringe feeding critical care and and uh, this energy medicine and just all this stuff trying to keep him keep him uh, well but you know we're gonna do everything that we can all right okay we just saw the doctor. Billy, you actually look pretty good right now, even though she's very worried. Um, his teeth are overgrown. His front teeth are extremely overgrown, Dr. Camper says. And she also says that she has a, a really cool tool. It's right there on the uh, bench there. And so she said that his back molars were curving over his tongue. and. He had his teeth trimmed about a month ago, so see how when, you, when they stop eating, how quickly it can, uh, they can grow back. So she's a little worried, too worried, or she, she doesn't think that he can, he's a good candidate for being fully, um, uh, for anesthesia, but she's going to sedate him, I guess, like a pain sedation. I'm not, I have to look up the, dictionary definition of sedation um, but she's just gonna get him woozy and because he's so weak she's hoping that with the the sedation has a pain element too that uh, he'll let her trim she says she won't be able to do as good a job as if he was put to sleep but um, she doesn't think that it, it's a good idea and that when he gets stronger then we can, um, we'll do that. So first thing is get him comfortable. We'll do it the best trim we can. And I think she's going to do some blood work too. Um, cause in this state, he might have developed a, a fatty liver disease. Billy, you're foie gras. I hope not. All right. So we're just chilling. We're waiting for an estimate and they're prepping everything. Um, and I called yesterday and I told them what was going on and, and we made sure to block time for a, a tooth procedure. Billy, but you look good even though his eyes are sunken and he's pale. His temperature was normal, 100.1. Um, but I know Billy and, and I see he's got a, a little spark in his eye and a strong spirit. So I need to get something to eat because this is... It's tough on the heart. When you're taking care of your animals, you gotta make sure to take care of yourself. That was actually one of the comments in, in, in the first uh, Billy video. So it's very true. It's tough when, when you go through all this stress, but you gotta stay. I made sure to get a good night's sleep last night so that I'd be alert because I had to drive almost an hour to get here. Okay, there's no point in rambling. We'll, we'll check back when we know what's happening. Right. What kind of a beast is that? I know, right? <laughs> Billy's awake, or they're going to get him now, and uh, they trimmed off all of this of his teeth. One of his bottom uh, front tooth was actually broken off at the gum line. So he's coming, and they're going to uh, try to feed him and try to just get these treatments going. His stomach's completely empty. His liver 
is like fatty liver disease, which they say is reversible. So it's just a matter of babying him, babying his liver and getting uh, food in his belly. That's what's going on. Come on. Come on, baby cakes. Hi. No, don't know. Good boy. What do you think? Oh. That's just regular green. Uh, just critical apple care, the banana. apple banana flavor, yep. yep. Yeah. He likes it. He does not like the Sherwood. Oh, yeah. He likes the Sherwood banana stuff, the pre workout stuff, but not. Pre workout? Well, that's basically what's energy and electrolyte. There you go. Huh? Let's see if he pukes. You can swallow it down, no problem. All right. Yeah, like I was taking one of those and I sawed the end off of it and I was mm -hmm. just like, whoop, 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 and mm. he would do like a third at a time or even a half. Mm. And then he just stopped. There you go. Yeah, able to swallow now. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Maybe, right. maybe there'll be something from the Tooth Fairy. We'll see. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> awesome. Good. Good boy. You chewing? Are you speeding? Are you speeding? Oh, there goes a little. Uh oh. You just, Did I give you just, too much? Just too much. I'm sorry. But when he was puking before, he'd go like, ah, yeah. and then it would just drool out. Oh, yeah. But yeah, look, he's chewing. Good, 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 good. Really? Good. I'm not sure when was this. He's awake. He just had a snack. And he needs to eat every couple hours. Yeah, what would the last one on the account be? Let me see your teeth, Billy. Let me see. Okay, is this regarding Let me see. Okay. Let's um, show them your teeth. It looks like when uh -huh. you were here, you saw Dr. Bay. Oh my gosh. One of our relief veterinarians. So she, she actually only comes in when we don't have any doctors, any of our regular doctors on the So she pulled his tooth out because it was broken. I think things are going to be okay. <laughs>